Hey, what is up, y'all? Welcome to Game Day with Heavy Cardboard, where we teach, play, and discuss medium and heavy strategy board games, war games, 18xx, and trick-taking. Apparently, I'm your host, Edward Euler. Happy to be joined by some very, very good friends of mine. Jess. Shrey. Martin. She said that with confidence that <clears throat> she's Jess. Right? <laughs> All right, today we are bringing y'all Nokosu Dice, uh, designed by Yasuke Matsumoto and published, uh, or being republished, I should say, by Big Cat Games. Also was previously published by End Games and Quoth Games, I believe it was. Uh, but Big Cat Games uh, just announced that the pre-orders are going on today. I would like to say we timed that very, very well. We did. Not on purpose, but we did time that very, very well. So welcome everybody watching live around the world as well as after the fact. Before we get started, a big thanks to all of our patrons who help support the show and make all of this possible. Thank you to all of y'all who helped choose to support what it is that we do here at Heavy Cardboard. So if you do like what we're what we do here and the content that we provide for you guys and hopefully hours of entertainment, don't forget to like the stream down below. And give us your thumbs. <laughs> Do that for our sake, please. <laughs> Subscribe down below as well, and you can go to pledgehc.com if you think the content we provide is worth a buck or two each month. All right, Nokosu Dice. I'd never heard of this until last weekend, and then Shrey brought this by. And you guys had played this before, right? Mm -hmm. And um, I like trick-taking games. This one's a... This is definitely going to be a bit different uh, and and hard. It's going to be a real brain burny thing. So uh, y'all ready? Hopefully y'all are ready. Let's dig into Nukosu Dice, shall we? All right. So what do we have here? Well, it's trick taking game. I just went over what trick taking game is when we played our stream of the crew. So I'm going to assume that everybody watching understands the basics of trick taking. Well, in Nukosu Dice, we have five different suits that range each suit from zero to seven. You'll notice the font on the one looks a lot like a four. Be careful with that. So zero to seven for each of the five suits. In addition to that, there are 25 dice in various colors in all of the colors of the suits. So the dice will also be representing cards that are in your hand. So they are additional uh, things that you can play to follow suit or possibly to trump suit. So the game is played to where we're going to be dealt a number of cards to begin with. The entire deck will be dealt out. So as you can see, as an example hand, this would be my hand of cards. And while that's going on, each of us will also randomly draw two dice out of the bag of 25 dice. And let's say for argument's sake that I took those two dice we're going to roll them, and then whatever numbers they end up, they end up. So just like in my hand that I have red cards and I have yellow cards, I'm going to have possibly red and yellow dice as well as other colored dice as well. After we have all drafted, or I'm sorry, randomly drawn two dice out of the bag, we are then going to randomly draw another three dice, not randomly, we are going to draft <laughs> three dice of the 13 that will be out here once we have all dealt our hands and gotten our two dice. So there's going to be a draft of 12 of the 13 dice that are available. And let's just say for argument's sake that I drafted the yellow four, the yellow or the blue four, the purple five, everybody else drafted some number or three other dice. And the die that was left was the red four. So now we need to talk about how tricks are taken. Now this is a competitive game, so there is no cooperativeness at all in this game. There is a hierarchy for Trump. Normally Trump is a certain suit or something along the lines of that that is chosen from various different ways. 
this game, trump is chosen by the color of the die not taken. So what that means is all red cards are now trump. So if you take a look at what would be my hand, it would be here, and that was a really bad example, I just realized, a moment. Let's say I also had, let's take these two cards out of my hand, and let's say we had those two in its stead. There we go, that is my hand of cards. All red cards are going to be trump, okay? In addition to, or the, they will be trump. Let me start there. In addition, the number on the die is going to signify what other nut what numbers are higher trump. So again, going back to my hand here, you'll notice that I have these fours. So not only are these two trump, but these two are trump as well. Not these are now colorless fours. They have to do with the numeric value on this. That is a four, and that is a four. They are, that is not a blue four. That is not a red four. Those are colorless fours because the number of the trump die is four. Does that make sense? Yep. Now, there is a hierarchy of things. The lowest trumps are the color of the suit. In other words, red are the lowest trumps. So when you play a normal card, let's say somebody led yellow, you would have to follow yellow just like normal. However, you have dice in front of you as well. So I could play, say, in fact, if this is my only yellow, I would have to play this two yellow die as following suit. This is a two of yellow. In addition, we have my hand. I have this card that also is a yellow. So it would be my choice to play the two yellow die or the six yellow card. But let's say for argument's sake that I did not have this six yellow, nor did I have this two yellow. Well, trump is red, so this is going to be a trump card, or a trump die, as it were. In addition, fours are trump as well. So both of those are colorless trump as well. So if somebody were to lead the seven yellow, I could, like a normal hand, I could slough something, any of those cards that you see here, or I could choose to trump it with any of the fours or any red card, or any red die or any four die, because these are essentially cards that are in your hand. Now, the hierarchy of trump is, at the very bottom are red cards and red dice, numbers 0, 1, 2, 3, 5, 6, in that order. Then above those are any fours of any color except for red. And then there is super trump, which is the, the king or queen, the top, the hierarchy, the top of the mountain trump is a red four. So you'll notice I do not have a red four here. However, I do have a red four here. And the reason Super Trump matters is because unlike most trick-taking games where the first of a Trump or first of a something would take it, it is the last one played unless it is Super Trump. Unless multiple people play Super Trump, then it's the last one of those played. So let me give a clear example of something that were played. So let's say Shrey leads this yellow seven. So then... Martin goes into his hand or maybe into his dice, and he plays, say, that three yellow. Well, we look at my hand of cards. I have no yellow. And we look at my dice. I have no yellow because these are trumps. Remember that. So I could go ahead and trump it, or I could slough. Let's say I go ahead and play a one of red. That is trump. Well, as it just so happens, Jess also does not have any yellow in her hand, so she plays a four. Fours supersede regular trump because that is the number of trump. So in this case, Jess will have won that trick. Does that make sense? Yeah. Yeah. So this die will then go back into the bag as being played, and Jess would then claim that trick. And we would continue playing until all of our dice, except for one, and all of our cards are used. Because at some point, you're only going to have one die left. And when you only have one die left, 
that is your bid for the number of tricks that you will have wanted to take. Because at the end of a hand, you are going to score one point for every trick that you have taken. But if it just so happens, let's say I ended up taking, say, four tricks, and those were, that is the die that is left for me, I will have nailed the number of tricks that I'm trying to get. If by doing so, I'm going to get some number of bonus points, depending on how many people have nailed the number of tricks that they are trying to take. If I am the only one, I will get 34 points, 30 bonus, and then one point for each trick. Does that make sense? Yep. If two of us nail our bid, then 20 points bonus each, plus one for every number of tricks. If three of us, then it'd be 10 plus the number of tricks. And if nobody gets it, well, you just get however many tricks you take. Now, there is one other thing that I have not mentioned, and that is, what if you just get dealt a really crappy hand and you say you want to bid zero tricks? Well, in that case, what's going to happen is you will have drafted a total of five dice, two randomly there, and then three other that you will have drafted. If before we begin the hand, after we have done all of our drafting, if you wish to bid zero, you say, hey, I'm going to bid zero. And we go in clockwise order from the player to the left of who dealt. They get to choose one of their dice to throw back into the bag because they're not going to have a number of tricks that they're taking. They're not going to have a die left over at the end. So maybe in this case, since four red is super trump, maybe I say, hey, I want to get rid of that. I feel like this might be ambitious, seeing as I have two trumps here. But as it is, maybe I choose to bid zero. If I bid zero, you get 10 additional points on top of whatever for nailing your bid. Otherwise, you just get the number of tricks that you took. And that is how you play Nikosu Dice. You play a total of four rounds, and whoever has the highest score at the end of four rounds wins the game. Any questions locally? Any questions from the peanut gallery? Yes. Okay, go for it. Um, the first question is, what if everybody plays dice? And really, I think what they're asking is, how do you mark that somebody won the trick? Hell Whoever, if I know. We have not encountered that. It's not hard. <laughs> you just would say one of the other tricks that you won. Always make sure that you're laying down the tricks you've won in a certain order, because you're not going to be able to count cards to see how many you won. Like that. So just a previous trick you won, you would move that card um, to make it notable that you had won an additional trick. Um, it still goes by the rules for, uh, you know, who won that trick. There we go. Um, and then what if all four match their bid? So that was that four if players match their bid. Nobody gets bonus zero points. Zero bonus points. That we've also yet to see that. Yes. All right. But you'd still get your points for the number of tricks you won. Correct. There you go. That's it. So I will bring up chat. I will bring up the cameras real quick. We will keep them where they were last time. There we go. And uh, I will shuffle up. Uh, if you guys want to start drafting uh, or uh, drawing your two dice, then I will put this back over here. There we go. And you guys will be playing from my point of view as well uh, as, as last time. And I will go ahead and grab two. Really? Try that again. There we go. All right, so 13 dice go out there, all but four. If you want to separate, you can take them out of the dice tray now, that, or we don't even have to no, use the fine. dice tray. It's pretty. Okay. It's not, it's not like Cut. A dice tray. Place your bets, and I will say uh, three and a half. So it's just under one per glory, one, no, four and a half, more than one per uh, round that we're going to play. So you look at your hand first before you uh, draft dice as well. Did I leave too many in there? There should be four uh, total. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. One more. Wait, four, eight. There's twelve in there. Yeah. And we need thirteen. Yes. But there's only four left in here. Huh? Do we? We're missing a die. How are we missing oh, a die? No. That's two. two. Oh, right here. <laughs> my bad for the example. My bad. My bad. No my worries. Bad. Okay. There we go. All right. So 
Take your cards. And because I dealt, Jess will uh, get first draft. And I get last licks to decide what will be uh, Trump. Trump. Okay. So I will, you get, like I said, you guys will be playing from my point of view. Okay, now I'm gonna have to shrink the screen so nobody can. See. Oh, nobody look. No, I'm not looking. I'm not okay, looking, not looking. well that's interesting. Okay, so hold on. Before you draft, let me show them my cards so they can see the dice. And there, hold on. Let me shrink this down so you guys can't see cards there. And here we go. That is my hand of cards. Mm -hmm. All right, we do not know yet what the Trump will be. It will be the whatever number and color that is not drafted. Okay, so there we go. All right, Jess, go for it. I shall. Um, There's not as much hate that. drafting as you might think. It's more, it's either, do you give yourself options? Or how do you do that? Well, it's evening it up. It's now any color. Okay. Uh, looking at my hand and looking at what's out there, because you want to start finagling your way. What do you want to leave? For Trump, right? Yeah, what even though want. you get last licks, we still are contributing to that. Oh, 100%. Um, you only get, get the choice of two. Vince, this plays three or four. I don't remember. There are rules for three player uh, play. Some cards come out. Some cards, yeah. And fewer dice, of course. Um, yep. There is going to be a certain number that I would like to be Trump that you guys could probably be able to tell uh, what I would like that to be. Um, so, with that said, looking at this, I think, and I have a one and a three already here, I like being able to give myself options for what number of tricks I will take. So there we go. Jess, you're up. Hmm. Um... No, those are not all the dice. There are four dice left in the bag. Yeah. So yellow will not be Trump. Correct. Mm. We know that. All right. Mm. Oh, I should take one of uh, No, you shouldn't. No, I... No, I'm just okay, kidding. Go ahead. I'll do that. In varied numbers seems to be a good thing to do. Give yourself some options. Yeah. I mean, he uh, says it's not, he said he wasn't a random thing, but I mean, this, when I'm playing, it might as well be. Blue will not be Trump. Blue will not be Trump. So red, green, or purple will be Trump, and the number will be two, four, five, or six. Checking what you guys might take. Um, that's all right. I'll take this. Five. All right. So red will not be Trump. Right. So I have the power to decide on uh, green Color. or purple. Yeah. Well, you at could. least it, well, I've got the, can force a green Trump. Um, but you I'm have no to. green. Dye. All right. So green will be Trump. Mm -hmm. We know this. So what we have gotten in the habit of is any of your Trump. We'll go, usually we'll put on our card if you're not bidding zero. Um, so looking out there, there are fives and sixes. There are a little bit of fours. There's not a lot. Uh, again, looking at my hand. Well, that played out exactly how I wanted it to for those scoring at home. Maybe not the color, it's but the numbers I did. for the rest of us. So, huh? Nothing. Oh. So I'm going to choose four to be Trump. Now, 
Not only am I choosing four to be Trump, but maybe I want the six because maybe I think I'm going to be able to take six tricks. We'll see. So four is going to be Trump. So that will go on the engine. That will get out of the way. So now everybody needs to, and if you'll excuse me, I'm going to do this so that nobody here can tell how I'm arranging my hand. So fours and green will be Trump, okay? And any fours are now colorless, so keep that in mind as well, okay? All right, so Jess begins, and green is Trump as well, right? And just because it's Trump doesn't mean, and you must follow suit just like in a uh, normal trick-taking game. So now people decide whether they want to... Oh, right. Bid. Does anybody want to bid zero? So, so starting with Jess. No. Shrey. Nope. Martin. Nope. I do not. Okay, so Jess begins. Here we go. Okay, wow. Starting with Trump. Mm -hmm. mm. So the hierarchy, again, the bottom is green cards or green dice, then fours, and then the green four is super Trump. Right. Hmm. So a four. So if I were to play a four, I would beat Martin because I will have followed Martin. Yeah, that's in the that interesting case. thing in this, the fact that a follow of the same beats. So I will go ahead and play this right here. So I win that by playing the latest Trump of the second tier of Trump, which are the numbers. Does that make sense yep. to everybody at home? So I won one trick. Uh, Vince, it's just that if he does that, what you're asking for, I can see his entire hand. So he has to make it cattywampus like that yeah. in order to play without yeah. me seeing his hand. Yep. Over We're over. doing our best, but he can't do the normal cam. It is, it is actually the same cam you're used to. It's just yep, turned it's so I just can't see it. It's just at an angle, right. Um, so now... Did that fix my card? Just let me know. Come there in. you go. So there's that. Can't see the screen. And yeah, you're good. I can see that. Okay. Good. So yellow. Six. <sighs> So Jess played a six later, so she will be winning this trick as of right now. All right. So this goes back into the bag. And there we go. Hey, Ronaldo. Just there. I know for a fact they can see it. Good. Mm. Oh, Ronaldo. Friend of mine. Oh, okay. Yay. Excellent. All right. Good to see you on stream. Is he down in where? In uh, London, right? You're okay. at the moment. Nice. Oh, have you back in Brazil? I can't remember. I lose track of. He's a work colleague of mine, and we I, move I around gather, so I much, gather. it right. you can never remember. Mm, more drawing Trump. Uh huh. Wow. Mm, somebody likes drawing Trump in this game. Just like messing with your plans. Yeah, no, that, that, that <laughs> does lead to... There's somebody who really hates that. <laughs> I'm not super keen on it, but I'll deal with it. Okay. okay, so now I have a choice to make. Hmm. So I'm going to play this card because I want to win it. That'll be the second four or the last four played, mm -hmm. and nobody played a green four. So that's two tricks for me. Um, hmm. Getting rid of the one. I'm not going to be able to take only one trick, as you can see, so getting rid of the purple die. I could do it a different way, but I'm choosing to do so that way. Hmm. Okay. Back in Brazil as of last year. Hmm. Yeah, we'll use this. Okay. All right. 
yours. Thank you out. Yes. Uh, which way do I want to lead? You must follow suit if you can, so I'm going to play this one here. Uh, okay. All right, so green, Trump, mm, yep. so Shrey gets that, meaning he has no purple. He has no purple dice, so that yep. that checks out. Um, let's let's blow this blue six. Could have played the blue five if I wish. Second blue six wins it. left to go in this because three for me out here and five in my hand. So blue is lead. So Martin has a blue die. I have a blue die. Oh, yes, of course I have a blue die. Hmm. Uh, yeah, sure. You're welcome. And... I'm electing to play, I think I'm going to go with the blue die. So seven takes that. Yep. And keep in mind, I don't have a blue die. If they're watching right, because the yeah, four is Trump. Yep. And let's play this red five. Okay. Uh, probably to where it's public information last year. I'm not 100% sure. Go with a six. Plus, you're not going to have an even distribution of, of numbers this way. True. There we go. So the six is taking it as of right now. I get it. Okay, it's two tricks for me. Everybody's got two tricks. Nope. That one die is not one I want to keep. <laughs> Not with two tricks, it isn't. Exactly. The reason separating the dice to remind trumps. Yep. So four is a trump, and Edward six and three are green, so they're trumps. Which yeah. are now trumps. Green. Yep, yeah. exactly. And colorless and green, right? Yep. So there you go. No, you, your bid is whatever your last die is. You don't get to choose it, per se. Yep. So you so. could be forced into a die you don't want. Correct. Yep. Oh so boy. getting rid of dice early is good because you're locked into it and you don't have to worry about it, but it's also bad because you you're locked into, into it. it. Yeah, you don't have as much <laughs> And you have to worry about it. Yep. Yeah. This is where my game is decided. Let's see what happens. All right, so he so took I the third. Away. Yeah. And so that now means he wants to have the five. five. Yes. So he's probably not going to lead yellow. <laughs> Just saying. He might have more yellow cards in his hand. But or he wants to get rid of it. Or he leads yellow to play the two. Get rid of it, two. because yeah, otherwise someone could push him into that. My That'd bad. Be yeah, bad. Yeah, yeah. See, even I screw this up, right? Personally, I'd, get, I'd like to get rid of the ones I know I can't get. Right, because sometimes you can get forced mm. into it. And that's because we're all jerks, and that would be exactly what we would do. Well, <laughs> some more than others. <laughs> hey, it's been done to me, too. And oh, I don't no do arguments. It to myself, so. so, what does Edward have? That's the question. Cool. Yes, I did. So, Martin could have played that, could have played the three, couldn't play the four because that's Trump, right? Yeah. Yep. Um, 
Hmm. Mm, yes, yeah, so you're not going to get. Uh, it's unlikely you're going to get six, so you might not want to take it with it. Right. So looking at my hand here, and looking at what I have out here, I'm unlikely to take six. I think this would be three. <sighs> Yeah, we're going to play that as Trump. Huh. You completely overlooked that move, did you? No, 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 I don't, <laughs> I, I, I don't know why he's doing that. Okay. Okay. Because he doesn't think he's going to win. More than... A bunch more. Mm. But this oh, is going to be his third oh, trick. This will be my third trick. Hold on. <laughs> And then Shoot. He, he will. Hold on, yeah. hold on. It doesn't mean he's going to win that. You're right. So, in that case, that. Never mind. Yeah, if you had like yeah. a, a, something in your hand that would overtake the six, then, but he doesn't yes, know that. That's true. That's a good point. Right. And nothing to change, so I had time to change it. There we go. <laughs> you tell yourself whatever story. Yeah, 100%. <laughs> yeah. Um, hmm. All right, so everybody followed suit, except me. I trumped it, so that's three. Gotcha. Thank you. Um, so now I am locked in to sit my bid of six. So I this is no longer Trump. This is just my bid. There you go. So Edward needs three more tricks. Shrey needs two more tricks. Wow. Hmm. Yep. Well, I think there's going to be some disappointments. Yeah, I, I'm fairly certain I'm not getting it. Yeah, I should have tried to stick to two. But that seven green in my hand was like, I don't yeah. know. I would need it. I need to lose on a, on a four, and there's one four left. So uh, I have to do this. Oops, that's two. You should get rid of it. Yes. Hmm. So, which way do I go on this? Do you want it? Do you not want it? I want it, do I not want it? I've got a bit of flexibility here you do? with my yeah. dice. And taking, my feeling is on the whole, taking tricks may cause more trouble than not, although, of course, Jessie's looking slyly and she's got a two in her hand, so. Uh, the fact that it's the last one played that takes it, as opposed to the first one, that so little subtle thing, it, it really can make mm. it brutal. It yep. does. Because you're like, yeah. Be like, oh, I can slough that. No, I would play afterwards. No. Yeah, yeah so yeah, it's well, really, Do I really take tricky. it with the four and then lose any chance I have to deal with another trick? Then I'll be guaranteeing myself I'm not going to take any more tricks. And then you're stuck with that. I'm going to take it with a four. Okay, right. so because four is Trump per that. All right, so Martin now. Martin has yellow. Two. Two. So now that, get, that locks me into three. <clears throat> I'm seeing you know, these two both really want to win tricks. So hopefully that's going to be to my advantage. Hey, look, so that's super Trump. Super Trump. So the only thing that can beat that is another green four. Which nobody has, because nobody has a green four die, and, and that's the only purple. green four. Yeah, and we have to play purple if we have it. Correct. But yeah, we're not beating but that. That's my only chance to be able to get six, and that's never going to happen. So <laughs> I wasn't going to only get three because of the super trump card. So oh, I was kind of foobarred so a little bit. Right. Yeah. Now, it is interesting how you you have to do this kind it's of dynamic beating during yes. the game. That's yes, it's a nice touch. Yep. Do I slot those and just stick with two? I can't win with the five. Right now you're saying, yeah, that's an interesting thing. Mm. So the hierarchy of Jess's two trumps right now is the, the four tr is higher than the five because it's right. the same number. But if you put the four now, it would not win. Even Correct. Though it's later. Right. So there would be right. a good way to slough it if that's what she's trying to do. Right. But then yeah. the five is what's left, and yeah. If you're not oh, going to make your so bid, bad. then force others to not make theirs. Exactly. Last year. Yeah. 
Uh, eh, I didn't think there was any way he was going to win it because too many, too many other people, people want tricks. Want tricks. So well, one of these two is going to try and take right. it if I didn't. So. I mean, Jess, Jess may be able to get away with only two, but she's sitting on two big trumps there. Yeah. So she's going to struggle to only get two. So she's probably going to have to win at four. So mm -hmm. I reckon everybody wants tricks. Yes. That is a safe assumption. Well, that's why I went with three. Right, and that's, get rid of that. There you go. Oh, that so. hurts. <laughs> All right, so Shrey sloughed, didn't follow. I super trump just essentially sloughed a a Only a, a four trump. green was going to win that. Right, yeah. so there you go. So there's four for me. And then I have two cards left in my hand. There's that. Wow, no one trumped that. I'm not going to, then. That's five. Well, that's a point, if nothing else. And then, the last card, yellow. Oh, thank the Lord. Um, oh, but I... Yeah! <laughs> See, here's the rub. If just... I have no choice. I'm not getting the four. So she keeps me from getting it as well. Right. Yeah. So that's... So it. she's setting me. How do I get rid of my Trump? Yay! <laughs> there we go. Yep. <laughs> 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 oh. All right. So here, so now that that's done, I will move this out of the way. So here we go. So I did not make mine, so I just get, or back up, who did make theirs? Only Martin. So only Martin, somehow we let that happen. Yeah, we're in trouble He, he now. gets 30, 30 bonus plus three. Yeah. So Martin is at 33 points. I got five. Shrey? Three. And Jess? Uh, three. There we go. So that's where we're at right now. Uh, Please. Wow. Okay, so Jess is shuffle, and we get rid of all the dice back into the bag, and then start drafty or start uh, randomly drawing. I'll enjoy my brief moment of glory because one thing I know uh, is it's going to be brief. That's a uh, that's a heck of a uh, start, though. No. Yeah, that's a good start. Yeah, that, that four and that last when he had the four and the six choice of the green, I was like, please take the six, please take the six, because I had no fours and uh, and I was hoping that I would be able to pull off a high number, a high uh, bid, but. You want me to get your two for you, or you want to grab them? I'll grab them. Okay. Superstition. Sure. You know, it's bad luck to be superstitious. It is. All right, so then all but four. So one, I think that's four in my hand. One, two, three. yep. So now we will just do like so. There we go. If you'll organize those, please, guys. And here, I'll let you guys draw the back. Oh, extreme reds here. Yeah. Being very tentative, so I'm desperate not to accidentally turn them over. All right. That's a very attractive mix. All right, so here is my hand. Interesting. Okay. Along with these dice. So, Jess Delp. Shrey, it is your honor, sir. Can we, can we call interference and, like, trade? <laughs> <laughs> take that. Oh. Hey, Tony K just said that was interesting, just bought a copy. Awesome, cool. Nice. Big Cat Games is here in chat. They're the ones that are uh, bringing it here to the States, so thanks to them for uh, bringing this over. This is uh, pretty cool. Um, wow, have some sixes, why don't you? Um, Feeling lucky? <laughs> well, do you, punk? <laughs> I'm going to take, there's only two ones available, so I'm going to go that route there. 
because <laughs> you needed the one. <laughs> um, it's always good to have a one. Oh my goodness. Hmm. You want a spread of dice because you've no uh, until you know what trump color and number is going to be. You got no idea whether your hand is strong or weak. Yeah. Oh yeah, actually you do. Well, you got a bit of a clue from yeah, the numbers, I, but maybe. it's still but it still can swing a lot depending on the. That is true. Yes. On the that trump is spot and on. Yes. color and uh, number because both of them will clobber you. You might think, I've got all of these ones, I've got a weak hand. Oh, one's Trump. Oh dear. <laughs> right. Oh my. Well, one's not Trump now, so there we go. Mm. Okay. One of the, no, I don't want that. Mm. Yep, I'm going to go with that. Hmm. Mademoiselle. Mm -hmm. Everyone's all like, "Ah, right, well, if I do this, and seriously, carry mm -hmm. the one, and <laughs> it's not it's happy to do so. It's a pretty good. It's pretty pretty clever game." Mm. Um, okay, Mike says, uh, "Bought this at Pax Unplugged. Our game group loves playing it." Oh my, Shrey. Yep, it's gonna be one of those two, and I. Actually, let's see. So if that, I think it's this one. Well, radio. So I could force Jess's hand to make red and sixes. Trump. Sounds good. Let's do it. Seriously, never give me any choice. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> Moving her does agency. give me a super trump. Actually, oh, look at that. Two super trumps. It gives me two super trumps. She does. And three trump. Two so boring trumps. I have this. That you can see. Correct. So, there is my hand. Yeah, okay, there. Okay. And my dice. All right, so now... Yes. Uh, Shrey, yes. are you bidding zero? Yes. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> okay, so now he is bidding zero, so he gets to take one of his dice to get rid of. A what, a high-powered two? <laughs> well, actually, no. It's Trump's interesting. interesting. I could get rid of the Trump. Yeah. You or could. I could get rid of the... I'm getting you rid would, of the Trump. I would think you would want to. Yeah. Right. I'm not bidding zero. Come on. So should I, should I flip this maybe or something? Yeah, flip it to the... There you go. Side. Saying I'm taking zero. Yeah. There you go. Um, I honestly was considering it. Really? Hmm. So, Nikosidis is actually from End Games Toyama in Japan. Um, Big Cat Games is the official international market distri distributor. There you go. Okay. Huh. I'm not. This is my hand again. And six red. So all sixes. And all red. Um, hold on. Nope, I'm not. I'm not. I think I could. But I'm not going to. So, Jess, are you going zero? With no. Two super trumps? Yeah, well, I, I, I understood, but you got to ask. So, Shrey, it is your honor to lead. Got to ask. Uh, we will start with, with a, hey, I don't want this trick. That's what mm. that means. Let's try to make Shrey win. <laughs> yeah, that, that is definitely my goal, is to set Shrey. Uh-huh. And Martin. And we can see what he has. Right. He's got a three over there in purple. Make that happen next. Mm. Do you want this trick, Martin? Interesting question. Uh, I might lean towards it, depending on what everybody else is doing. Hmm. I guess Edward's having it. I guess well, the trunk goes down. he is. I have no purple dice.
Hmm. So we'll say, and I know I should say this at the end, but I can't help myself. It's interesting being to the right of somebody who pulls zero because you know that they're never, hopefully for them, going to win a trick, which means you're never going to have that Fear. end of the yeah. trick ability to mm. decide if you win, which is really beneficial in this game. So while I also have all these tricks, I'm in a little bit of a conundrum because mm. I'm unlikely yes. to be that last person to play. Uh... <laughs> Some super Trump jokes going on here. Yeah. Or a super tramp, I should say. Yeah. It's going to be a long day. <laughs> Taking the long way home. Yep. How many is Edward going for? I mean, he was going to play zero, and now yeah. he's just taking all the tricks. I considered it. Um, and you guys want at least three. You would think. Oh, I hate this position. A lot. So what's been interesting is Jess has been to my right every single time we've played this game. Oh, no purples. Mm. Hmm. But going second sucks a lot. Oh, so sorry. Okay. Well, I guess Shrey I'll, is set. All right. I will do what I can <laughs> to take tricks from other people then. Exactly. Yep. <laughs> oh, I had the I had a purple oh, guy. I thought I could have oh. played after all. Oh well, too late now. <laughs> Martin, he seems so nice. <laughs> okay, so what do I need to do? No shirt, no shoes, no dice. How about? Well, let's just take this one. No way. It's the best I got for fast times. All right. Mm. Um. We'll go ahead and get rid of that, I think. You know what? No, we won't. You got a three right there. Yeah, we'll go ahead and play that bad boy. So the seven takes it. From zero <laughs> to two. I don't know that you wanted to unleash that on us right now. Um, let's see what people have. So there's Trump. Mm. No yellows? Okay. Oh, and that's Trump too. Mm. Hmm. Oh yeah, speaking of uh, demands, if you guys didn't see, here, let me show, uh, while you're thinking about this here, Martin, a moment. So this uh, Rome demands tea was a uh, was a gift from what I think what I think was my secret Santa. So that that's awesome. It came from um, the psychology department at Oxford University, which is pretty amazing. So that, that was, itself was pretty that was awesome. pretty cool. Yeah. Uh, all right. So green three. Um, well, everybody has at least a three. So everyone's got to follow suit no matter what. So I think. We'll go ahead and play. Ooh, careful. Check that. Let's put that back. Let's look at my dice, shall we? So yeah, I think we're gonna play this, actually. Jess is currently winning that and, yeah. and did win that with the three. The second three. And Jess is going to take get six. six. That has got to happen. Well, that's three pretty strong candidates for yep. three of the. Oh, uh, that would be four, so she yep. needs two others, probably, right? 
Um, I know. <laughs> yes, it is an amazing mug. Yes. If you mm. saw his dice, he might have just flipped me the bird under the table because <laughs> you should stick to your two. That's Trump, right? Yeah, yeah. Mm. that's Trump. But you have to follow suit. I do. Mm. So you might not want to win anymore. You're right. <laughs> I like my chances of that, actually. Given how many I have to get, I might have wanted you to not want to win anymore. <laughs> <laughs> that works out. Team player. Oh, Team player. Right. <laughs> All right, Mr. Fowler. Yeah, <clears throat> you should hunt. 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 What in the world are you saying? Stop. <laughs> I, I don't know. Hunt Trump. Hunt Trump. Oh. Mm. Oh, well done, Christopher. No, not Cambridge, because it's, what, CFE, right? Or C -G -E. C -G -E CGF. That was it. Mm -hmm. Cambridge uh, oh, Game yeah, yeah. Factory, yes. is, right, for the yeah. mug. No, that's the mug. Yeah, I know, yeah. but he's saying it would have been even more ironic. Oh, I been. see, yes. Yeah, C, C for Cambridge. C, 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 C. get it? Don't do okay. that. I'm going to end up showing my hands, trying to defend myself from being tickled, so can we just not? <laughs> oh, I support this. That is Trump. Mm, it is. I'm stuck at two tricks. Mm. That is my hand. Second six would take it, so Jess yep. is taking it as of right now. Nope. Nope. Shrey says, I will trump that. Keep it zero when you had a six. I did. Yep. Mm. Mm, that's wow. But, but sitting like, yeah. sitting like, oh, it's that. With those, yes. Yeah. There's a chance that... Uh... Um, let's do... Let's do this one next. So just blue. Blue. Jess desperately needs to win these, doesn't she? Mm-hmm. Not me. So Martin's winning it with a four currently. So is this making sense to everybody at home? You guys able to follow but along? But literally just blue. We're not playing Trump right now. Well, yep, you right could, blue. but right. Yep. Just making sure I wasn't missing something yep. on Baby the Baby Trump. That's, mm. that's a good one to take with Baby Trump. That's right? what I was yeah. saying. Like, I wasn't mm. doing something wrong with my Baby Trump. Nope. Uh, so... Trumps. So, Super Trump. So, Trump has to come out. So, But you'd have to play a red six. I'm going to play this one here. So, where can she find her third one? Assuming the other two sixes. Well, win. no, one of those has to stay. Oh, correct. Two others. Good call. See? Mm. Still, still uh, trips us up. I don't like the fact that you have met your bid and you seem seems unlikely. Seem confident? Yeah. Mm. Um, uh, Not going to play this. I'm going to play this now. one instead. And Trey won't have any dice left over because he bid zero. Yeah. Mm. Super Trump wins that. Right. And Martin... Sloughed a seven. Interesting. So he's going for... Okay. I assume... I'm going for four or three. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Checks out. <laughs> 
what does that tell you about what I've got left in my hand? Oh, interesting. That is the, the only thing, nothing beats that, sorry, except, no, yeah. no nothing beats that. I had that. a lot of super trump. Wow, mm. you had three super trump. That's, I did. Wow. Oh, so, I know Just doesn't have any of that, so I'm going to play this. So, Super Trump gets that, ma'am. That's a fifth. Yeah, one, one to one. go. Tense. Tense. You mm. cut it with a knife in the room. Oh. What do you have? Oh, talking about Martin. I know, he has something. <laughs> well, she knows he has the purple four, the blue three. I'm going to assume. No, I don't want to say anything. And he has one card left. This Trey and I each have two cards. Oh, it can't be Super Trump because I had the Super Trump. Correct. But it could be a goddamn six. <laughs> I wasn't counting. Sparkles. The six. I don't know why I don't count the six. The six <laughs> you would think you should. I wasn't either. I was counting the fours last time. Oh, the six is counting is too hard work. I counted in bridge for a long time, but it was. I never liked count card counting. If you guys are enjoying this, don't forget to give a thumb down below. Appreciate it. Subscribe to the channel, too. And there is a six, so six will be there. I will play that. So there's three, so that means Martin's going to play a purple four, I imagine. Or is he? Well, so it's interesting, isn't it? Really it really is. Do you think you're going to Do gonna I think I'm going to win it? No, I don't. I'm going to go for the four. I reckon there's something out that's going to be. Oh! Oh! Yeah. Thank so, Jess got hers, Martin. Martin got his, I got mine. <laughs> mm. oh. Wow. All right. Oh, man. That was so, fun. three of us got it, so that's 10 bonus points each. So, I'm only getting 12. So, here, I get 12 for that. Martin, unfortunately, gets 13. That hurts. Shrey uh, gets three. three. Oh. And Jess gets 16. 16. Mm -hmm. Well done. Well done. With that. No, I won the last. Oh, Shred, who won the last trick? Jess? Jess to get her yeah. six. Oh, to get so six. you yes. got yours. Yeah. yeah. So All three right. of us got hit. Which well, because it was six, yellow six. Yeah. yeah. I mean, if it was gonna, if, yeah. if people were going to get it, that's the way for me to... to, to I knew you had a six. Yeah, you want I that. I knew right. you had a six. I was like, I can't lead with the and six. And I was, I was thinking, she's probably got something left. And yeah. then when you put the six down, for some reason my, my mind was going, oh, that's not a trump. I blew it. All right, draw your two, sir. There you go. Uh, uh, since Sita, 1937, I don't know the game, so, all right, J-Rex, Christmas, and Shrey, just giving him a moment. Yep. Uh. Uh, thank you. All right, uh, all but four. Um, kind of, Eric. It's different. So it's 30 if you are the only one to hit. Yeah. 20 each if two hit. Yeah, I don't know if that's going to show. 10 or each not. if three hit. So. And zero if all four hit. All right there. Okay, that's the bonus chart. Hopefully you guys can see that. Okay. It's blue sixes are popular this time. Could be Trump. We shall see. There we go. All right. That's my hand. Huh. All right. Okay. Um, hold on. So that one should be there. Since we're going button on the top. Oh. You're the one who needs to arrange things. All right. So, right. Uh, 
Wow. Wow. You look at the dice out there and you look at my hand. I find that interesting. Um, there are no, almost no low cards out there. Or low dice out there, as it were. Hmm. Take care, Chisholm. Have a good night. Kevin, I've heard people say that about uh, Kanban. Shrey, your honor, sir. Yes. Um, that's this one. Uh, no, sorry, not that one. This one. Okay. Okay. I know what I want you to choose. So it'll be yellow, I'm sorry, it'll be blue or red that will be Trump in mm -hmm. five or six. We've streamed the original Kanban, pretty sure, many, 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 many moons ago. Yes. Hmm. hmm. All right, Shrey. Shrey can dictate it be red. And a five. And a five, if he wanted to do it. Or he lets Martin... Make the Rookie. decision. So. This is interesting, though, because you almost, if you get the red five and he leaves that, you've got super Trump. Right. But who knows? Who knows? Otherwise, you're giving knows. him super Trump. That is that. Which, depending on what you're trying thinking about bidding, that makes sense. Or doesn't, as it were. And either way, Martin's getting super Trump. Because he has Correct. a blue six over there. So if he leaves the blue six, he gets can super make Trump. Make sure that that has super or Trump. Or he gives Shrey super Trump. Interesting. It is interesting. Hmm. I'm going to let Shrey touch super Trump. That is not how I wanted that to go. Mm. All right. So all fives and all red are Trump. So a moment. Okay, so I'm going to rearrange my hand a moment. All fives and all red. Okay. Very good. Yeah. Whose lead is it? It's yours, but you decide whether you want to take zero trucks or not. Oh, that's true. No, I'm not taking zero. All right, a moment. Let me show everybody at home. All right, so there is my hand. All red and all fives, if I were to have any, would be displayed there, coupled with this. Do I wish to take zero? I do not. I do not. I also do not. All right, so everyone's taken some number of tricks in theory. Mm. Martin, it is your honor, sir. It is mine, yes. The honor is mine. Interesting. Martin has no trump. Showing. Showing. Hmm. Hmm. 
Indeed. All right. I assume that was going to be lead, believe it or not. So we're going with this one right here. Mm, yeah, let's do this one. All right, who's got the bat here? There you go. So I take that with the six. Mm -hmm. Um... Oh no, Franny. Well, that's horrible. I'm sorry, Franny. No. Oh. Ugh. Um. Let's let's hunt some green, shall we? Yeah, I mix it up as far as do I order high to low, low to high, and I don't have any rhyme or reason for the suit order, just as long as the suits are together, usually. If I'm holding my hand, sometimes I will mix up suits, depending on who I'm playing with. Yeah. Yeah, we're here for you, Franny. Mm -hmm. All right. Watching that. Okay. need that. So then... Let's see what happens here. That is a blue seven. That is a blue six. A moment. That'll be Trump. I don't think I win it, but let's see. Um, you want one, two, or four? That is a slough, sir. Mm -hmm. I'm winning that with the seven currently. Mm-hmm. Currently. Currently. That was really good tea tonight. So that five. would be Trump with the five. Your thumbs are appreciated. Subscriptions are appreciated. Pledge HC is also appreciated. Leading with uh, Trump. Six of Trumps. So play Trump. Okay. So looking at what I have left here, I have three yellow, and I have that in my hand. Gives me flexibility, I think. That would be the second six, so the six, this well, just, just is winning. winning. Yep. Hey, Steven. Australian house. I'll play a five. And the five beat is higher than any of the regular reds. Yep. So the five wins. Um. Hmm. I need to hold on to the, okay. I don't think. It's just purple. Yeah. Don't think purple. six is the, is the number for me. Oh, it gets past me. Yeah. It's a winning number so far. Hmm. 
so far. Da 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 da. <laughs> the big heavy sigh. Well, I always have to check my dice. I'm like, I don't have purple, right? Correct. You do not. So that's you, Trump. Hmm. Eight more tricks this this round. Yup. Agreed, Franny. It is. Mm. It's less, the more you play it, the more intuitive it becomes remembering that you have dice on the board, uh, on the table as well. Well, it's, the hardest thing for me to remember is that one of the numbers is Trump. Yeah. That, I actually find that even more trouble than the dice. Okay, one. oh yeah, that fives are yeah. not colored yeah. fives. They are colorless Trump. Yeah, yes. you're, 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 yeah. yeah, I just played a yellow five, right? And, I'm, and yeah. at one point, I you led yellow. I was like, I could, no. No, no that's I, Trump. Trump. No, I keep those on a different part the, of my yes. hand usually. Uh, yeah, yeah well, so right. when Jess played the six last time, I thought, oh, I've blown it because right. she's, well, oh, but no, that's Trump. <laughs> yes. Yeah. So I actually wanted to win the trick. Right. Well, at least I was happy with her winning the trick because I scored as well. Uh. But the fishing out of people's dice, making them play numbers they mm. don't necessarily want to well, play. Well, you having is all the nasty. same color is a really interesting tactic. Well, because now I have control over this. Uh huh. Yeah. Uh huh. That's nice. I, mm. I tried that. Plus, I actually was considering going zero, depending on how Trump played out. Mm -hmm. I don't know what to do here. So it's just the green four. Win it. I like it when you win it. It's great when you win it. Oh. I'd love for you to win this. <laughs> that way Jess goes last. Uh-huh. <laughs> 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 He's winning that right now. So far. And, and he does. Oh, okay. We'll see what happens. That's three. I've got likely a fourth. Likely with, with Super that. Trump. Likely. Yep. Um... But right now, I don't want it. Unless, well, no, I can't hit. Yeah, I definitely won't get it. Mm, well, I don't think I'm going to get six. Sloughing. Hmm. I have a decision to make, so you all see that when you see this. Yeah, I want to, I want to look at the screen because yeah. you're talking about <laughs> what you're going to do. Um, yeah. You know what? Oh. Now Jess has a decision. She does, and I wanted to make her make a decision on this. Well, no, it led green. I have to right. choose between the two green dots. Oh, that's good. It. Right. Right. Oh, never yeah, mind. But, but whether I don't know it's a two you're... or the four, I apologize. That's right. it. You're right. You're Which right. Is, it, is it the two or the four? Um... Playing lots of board ga uh, card games in our six form common room as well, for any six so. form common room is that a yeah I that would be an, that would be a British thing. Okay. So the six form is basically your sixth and seventh year. It's called six form. Don't ask me uh, why. In school. In school. Okay. Yeah. So and then like the common room high, was, okay. would be where you could kind of hang out. Oh, okay, well, gotcha. actually, we tended to hang out in the maths room, which they okay. opened up. So I took that games. with Trump. Yeah. Okay. So that's three. So let's go ahead and do that. Every lunchtime is playing games. Okay. So. Um, glad glad you guys are enjoying this. Let's just take that's it. super Trump. Unless you odds, have. odds are, Ooh, odds are that's handy. Yeah. Okay. okay. Make sure that happens now. And so Shrey's locked in at five, needing one more. Mm-hmm. Not bad. This will, I think. This will work. So, hunting Trump. That is Trump. Mm. All right, this is Trump, so I've got to play Trump. Oh, I'm going to move to my decision. So, I will play this. So again, I, I, so we played that five, I immediately thought green. I didn't think Trump. Right. 
if you haven't oh, said Oh, I didn't Hunting either, Trump, but I immediately look at what yeah. is the Trump. So, so Jess takes that with the later five. Yep. Okay. Giving her options still. Okay. Just the blue six. And the blue six will take it. Now Martin doesn't want any more. Indeed I don't. The less people who want them. If you have a high <laughs> bid, that is good. Yes. Mm. So Shrey so wants one, I want one, and mm -hmm. there are three left. And Jess wants... One, two, or three of them. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> so we could all be friendly and could get zero do points. Do a deal. <laughs> yeah. So it's no, like, that's Martin the wants thing that is being don't. friendly is yes. not good. Yeah. <laughs> and they made sure of that. that yeah, we are not going to want to do yeah. that. We need Martin yeah, to get a trick. Yes, yeah. we need Martin to get a trick. Right, yeah. But we all want tricks. So. Well, Correct. We all want tricks. Yeah. Um, yeah, so in this case, Martin's sitting in. Catbird seat, kind of. Yeah. Hey, kind of. Yeah. I'll show you in the house. Again. It's going to be hard, but yes. maybe that was my best chance to make him not get it. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It, it was like getting rid of the three right. on him was, I felt, the best calculated move. Now the question is do I want to. What do I think I'm going to get? You need one more. You need one more. One, two, three. Ah. Uh, Six of blue. Oh, sorry. There. Interesting. Fight for the last two tricks. Um. Yeah, because the problem is if I play that what y'all have. But I feel like I'm getting one more. <laughs> well, both Shrey and I are fighting lucky. for these. Keep that in mind. Yep. You are. I know you don't have... Oh, that's Trump. Yes, okay. indeed. Hmm. That is a that seven is of a, Trump. That is a seven of Trump. So I'll play this one then. That is a non-Trump. That is a non-Trump. And uh, that is the Trump, Trumpity Trump Trump. T t oh, it is a five. <laughs> Super Trump. Trumpity Trump Trump Trump. Yes. <laughs> Super <laughs> Trump is what that is. Oh, this is. He got his four. This is bad for me also. Oh, uh, okay. Go ahead. I can play Oh, whatever. so this is interesting. Yeah, Jess wants the slide. Oh, no. Oh, she's screwed. Maybe I don't know. Oh God! Yeah. Oh! <laughs> if she plays yes. the five, no. Calm down! I, this Stop! Is awesome. <laughs> you don't need to make me that stressed. I don't. Need Enough. To. All right. So. Hey, James. I can take it. Good night, Ezra. Maybe it depends on what you and saved. You, right. If you have a five, then I'm fine. And he wanted to win one. So I'm assuming he saved something. Yeah, I'm going to hope that you saved a five. I did not. Oh, man. All right. So five. Jess takes that. Yeah. Five or the four. Also, my heart stopped a little bit when you led that zero. I thought, there's a chance I might win a trick. <laughs> All right. So I got mine. Jess not. did not. Nope. Trey did not. Martin, unfortunately, did. So that's 21. 21 for Martin. That is 24 for me, because two of us got it. Shrey got four, oh, wow. and J-Rex got five. So going into the final round, that's 24 for Jess. That is a 10 for Shrey. That is, oh my lord, 30, 40, 50, 67 for Martin. Uh, and I'm at 30, 41. Uh, Martin needs to get set, no matter what. And I, I think he's still too far out in the lead yeah. to catch. So 
Martin may have locked this up in the first. Because even if you get 26, you tie him. So you you would have to be. You're the only. I'm one the only one that can get it to ca to catch him. Yeah. yeah. So all right. Thank you. Which is interesting because it means for me, I'm as interested in stopping Edward as I am in winning myself. Mm -hmm. Ma'am. Oops. Well, it would be better if he was sitting to the uh, to the right of to you. Right yes. To do that. And if you would like to draw your two. Or out and boom. All right. Uh, so, Luke, embarrassing confession. I don't actually know what defines a trick taking game. If you I go mean, back and watch our last stream, I actually explained that. Well, how to play you extreme, you explained. But I would say what defines a trick taking game is cards played in successive order with there being a trump suit. And, you know, basically rules for how the cards are played that can vary depending on the game, but somebody's going to trump or take the suit based on those rules. Yep. Um, so you're playing a round of cards played to take the trick. Yeah. No, I, I don't, don't think, think it has to be a trump, does it? I mean, no. um, probably When do you count a climbing game as a trick-taking game? Yes, there's climbing, yeah. Which so people cards will, played will argue for, that one yeah. way or the other. Yeah. 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 Following color if possible, high yeah. number. Win. High there number you go, wins. what Eric said. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. And high number can be defined differently yep. depending Correct. on what Trump is, if there's a Trump. All right. Looking at my hand, I immediately glanced at what is out there for dice. Mm. This is my hand. Well, okay. So given what I have and what I don't have here, I think this is the right call. There. Done. Mm. Yeah, three levels of trump. Super trump being the number and color of the die slash card, then the number of what the trump is of the die that was not drafted, and then the suit of everything in that color. Yeah, mm. there you go. Hmm. Looking yellow. at that yellow. Okay. again, um, I think I like this one. Could make a case for a couple of those, but this way Jess can see them a little better. There we go. Low angle. I'm not that short. <laughs> I'm like normal sized. It's you are. Fault that you're not all of us are giants. Yes, I understand that, right? <laughs> Gulliver. All right. <laughs> all right, blue will not be Trump, nor will green, for that matter. It is your honor, yeah, Martin. Oh, it's off. He just took the one yep. blue. Yellow will not be Trump. Mm. So, 
given the numbers and the colors that are out there, I have a bit of a uh, interesting decision here. It is a non 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 trivial. I guess double negative makes it a positive. So this is actually a really hard decision right now. Um, I'm gonna take that purple six. Apparently, just wanted said purple six. There is a purple five and a purple three, or a yellow three or four. Yellow, really? Red. Ooh. You okay there? Yeah, apparently not. All right. So uh, somebody asked, "Can you play with more than four players?" I believe this is. It's three and four only. Three, three and, four, and four, four only. Yeah. I've never played this with three. Yeah. Um, take that, name that. So you can choose. Oh, you shoot. can make it yellow or make it that purple is Trump. Ah, uh, that is hilarious. What is out there is really funny. <laughs> I'm glad. That was I, a good yeah. joke. I don't right. see the humor, but okay. I, yeah, right. Seriously. <laughs> I trust you. This is a very abstract form of humor. Right. Mm -hmm. You can explain it to us later on. Yep. Give us the punchline. I, I will definitely explain it at the end of the game. <laughs> uh, now I have to decide. Now my, now my decision has changed slightly. Um, looking at his dice, he might be thinking about going zero. Just looking at what you've chosen. Yep. And remember, if you go zero, you discard a die before the hand starts. Yep. I've gotten really good at making that screen very tiny uh. where you guys cannot see it. <laughs> <laughs> yep, yep. Uh, sorry, this, no, is, you're this good. is actually you're good. a, it's an interesting decision. And you can't explain why it's interesting, which yeah. is right. understandable, right? So, um, let's not let Martin make that yeah. decision. Yeah, there you go. Okay. Fair. Glory to Rome. Nice. Thank you. Yay, well done, Shrek. <laughs> So, that's not a huge decision. Do I make fives? Or do yeah, I the make problem threes? with the, the, the under for Glitter Romans was probably appropriate for this because. Yeah. I am going to make it five. You can't reveal, if you say Glitter Rome during a game, during after a hand, it yeah. gives a lot of information. It does, right. Yep. So. All right, so all purple and all, oh, good save. And all fives are Trump. So, I'm going to reorganize my hand now. So, all purple and all fives. And the purple five is super trump. Mm hmm. Which there are no super trump dice this time, so there's only one super trump card. Correct. <laughs> so there we go. Oh, there we go. Okay. Hmm. Are you taking... No, I'm not taking zero. Jess? Nope. Shrey? Nope. Martin? Nope. Okay. I lead, huh? Um, so purple and fives. Like a huge amount of what we call Black Mariah in England, which is basically a form of hearts. And as well as quite a lot of bridge. Hearts and spades have been the game I played the most when we were on ship, when we were deployed in right. Marine Corps. My buddy Junior and I were master spade partners, or spades partners. So, yeah, played on the bridge, played on the PK, which is a good two player. What is it? PK, which is a good two player trick okay. taker. And right. Bazique also is a two player. Not familiar with those. I played yeah, Euchre. But Black Mariah, Hearts, we would play at all sorts of numbers and mm. partnership combinations. Well, J Rex has no yellow. 
Radio. Uh -huh. okay. I kind of expected to take that. Um, Martin getting yeah. rid of the big one. Hmm. Get rid of the big one. Well, okay. <laughs> that may adjust this. <laughs> <laughs> Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's only four hands, but well, it, it, it's long only because it's so thinky. Because every single thing you do, right? And but I'm enjoying it though. Uh huh. Yeah. Mm. But we'll give our final thoughts at the end of this during the round table. Oh man, what do I want to do? I've never played rook. What is Rook? Oh, God, Never Rook's the best. It. It's a trick taker. It has a little crow on it. There's a lot of different remakes maybe, of it. Maybe it's I have. A, it's it's a, been around a long time. It's not a regular playing card game. It's a more Yeah, it has its own deck. It has its own yeah. decks, yeah. Okay. Uh, Wizard, technically, I guess, is a ladder, like, mm -hmm. in Tissue, yeah. but to mm. me, those are still trick-taking games. No, yeah. Wizard's, yeah. Wizard's not ladder. Climbing. No, no, no. Okay, no, yeah, you're right. Wizard's trick-taking. Yeah. Right. Tissue is Wizard's like, oh, hell. Yeah. Yeah. Um, it's a ladder game, but I still think of it as a trick-taking game. But yeah. So I mentioned last time about Rook and that I was punished as a child by my deck getting taken away. But I'm not an idiot, so I got another deck. <laughs> and I hid it under my mattress. And then, but my mom figured it out because she punished me one time taking the deck away. And I was like, that's fine, because apparently oh, right, I'm a little yeah. bit of an idiot. And she was like... Where's the other one? <laughs> so five and be more purple upset. are Trump. So there. Um, and you've got two greens. I do. In your hand. So we're going to play that. Hmm. It's a high green. It is a high green. Interesting. It mm -hmm. is. Didn't want to get rid of one of those others, huh? We'll see. I don't know yet. Yeah, Euchre is very much a upper Midwest game, like Michigan, Wisconsin uh, area. That I've heard very of it. much, I've never, yeah. Never that is, it. it's very centralized. I've noticed people from mm. there know that game. People outside of, and there might be a couple other states around right. that, but it's a very centralized game. Mm. Tonk is another that that tends to be more southern. I've Trump. Noticed. Yep, Hunt and Trump. Yep, come the Trumps. We know Martin has at least one. Jess has two. I have three. Because you don't know what your bid is, is what makes this game so damn hard. Mm. Playing a five, are you? I am. With that. All right, so there you go. So that el eliminated one of Jess's, and because she played after me, she wins. Same, same number. Okay, Indiana. Yeah, it's that's yeah, one Midwest, time I like playing much, after Indiana. you. Yeah, right. Yeah. Ah. Uh, hmm. What do you want? What do you want? It's Friday, right? I don't know. Yes. Leave yeah, that. happy Friday, everybody. Hopefully, you all have a great weekend. We potentially have a stream on Sunday, provided we have the players for it. That's not happening, so I'm going to get rid of that. Meaning, you're not going to take just two, not the stream. Independent <laughs> thought. <laughs> well, I mean, you're talking about something completely off. Yeah, I, yeah, my bad. Edward. Edward wants some number that is there. At He's revealing two. nothing. He's got options. Yeah, you're not helping me out there. Yeah. Mm. There you go. Indiana, Minnesota, Ohio, South Dakota. Yeah, see, the upper midway, yeah. upper Midwest, kind of, yeah, it really is. Yeah, this one. So if I have a blue, I must play it. And you I could will. win this with a... A Six four a with seven. a four, but I can't. So there you go. That's... Just a red seven. Making me make choices. <laughs> um. <laughs> 
That's a nice little bonus. I'm fine with that. Oh, nice. Have fun, Eric. Any games lined up for this weekend? Do that one. I like that chip. TGIF, TGIHC. That one's no longer any use to me. Well, they both have fours. <laughs> you mm. see that. So I guess we're going to start taking some tricks. Sure. Okay. So I played my four. There we go. So there's one. Um... So Jess is locked in at five. Mm -hmm. A moment. Um, it's on Trump. Jess does not, can't play that, so. And the reason I led that is because I want to try and force Shrey and Martin to make decisions on this now. And that is my hand. Remember that purple and red You have the super trump. trump. So super trump. Shrey has the super trump. So Shrey is playing that. So that worked out because I wasn't going to be able to get six, I don't think, anyways. So there we go. Shrey. So, yep, yep, because he played the five purple. Beats my six. That five, there you go. Um. Well, that didn't really limit that. No, it I didn't. Tried. I yeah, tried. tried. I tried at least, tried. but yeah. Um, yeah, no, I, I tried last year. I tried. I think I do this one. Okay, well. I'm Martin, trying also. Martin avoiding like hell uh, from making a decision. I, you cannot make me make a decision. So I, ha I have to play here because remember this is Trump. This is not a... Uh, Yellow. So right now Martin is winning this. Oh, well, the decision might be made for him. It might be. Well, let's see. Nope. Nope. J-Rex wins it. With baby Trump. Baby Trump, 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 Trump. Trump, 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 Trump. Trump. Right, yeah. Don't do that. That's so mean. <laughs> what is? Baby shark. Baby shark, but Trump. I don't. It's a song. You don't want to know. You don't want to know, yeah. Okay. Uh, parents apparently know baby okay. shark. You definitely don't want to know that. Hmm. Take care, Luke. Have a good one. Enjoy uh, Australia. Stay safe with the fires. Are they still as bad as they were? All right, so just a blue six. Hmm. Still just a blue six. Decisions, decisions, huh? Um, I agree. So. Still a blue six wins that. Wow. I hate that he has <laughs> options. <laughs> Sorry, Brianna. Oh, that's brutal, Brendan. I've had a Ooh. headache for 18 days. Ooh. Oh, God. Oh, no, my head hurts thinking of that. Yeah. Seriously. Oh, that's horrible. That is Trump. Oh, it is Trump. 
Thank you for pointing that out. I, I, I've been trying to do that every time, right? Yeah. Even when we're off yeah. stream. Because, yeah, it's very good, because right? otherwise right. I, I was, was, about th I was to, thinking, uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> That's me committed. Okay. Two, three, four. Any five takes that. Understood. Still don't want to commit, huh? So I'll take that with a ah, later five. Sounds good. So that's two. <sighs> that's what we have left in our hand. hard playing that first. I just don't mm. want Martin to be able to slough off any Trump he has is the problem. Mm, yeah. But whoever takes this, if they lead green, then I'm stuck playing that green potentially, unless I have green in my hand. I hate it, but... Pulsing Trump. Yep, so Trump is being led. Jess, uh, Jess is immune from playing her die. Martin's immune from playing his die. So what have I got in my hand? I hope Not so. Not something you thought was taking another trick. Say again? Not something he thought was taking another trick. You would think so, yes. Ah <laughs> <laughs> uh, um. So Jess is now winning this. You're welcome. Jess wins that. So Jess has her five. Jess, set, Martin. Here we go, J-Rex, here we go. Jess Which five, I have no idea what he two. has in his hand, so. All right, blue three. Discarding my high cards. I, th I think I have to take this. You don't have to. Okay, so let me let me think through this. I'll try and play this out loud so you, you guys see what I have. So if I take this, then I lead. Mm -hmm. But the question is, can I get away from the lead? But if I don't take this, I still might be able to... Yes. We have two hands left. Yeah, we have two. two left. There you go. Yeah, I think you're, I think you're got his three. I think you're fine. I need to. Everybody can make it. I think everyone's going to. Martin? Hmm. Oh, you can make him not, not make it. But if I do, then I don't get mine and I still lose. Take one for the team. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Martin has it locked up no matter what, I think. I'm this is the only chance, yeah, to not can make, is making him not cut it. But then I set myself, but I give you guys a chance to beat me. Maybe. Do we want to grow? Lock in second? Oh, you're taking not? it, huh? No. Oh, no, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm back at red. Okay, so you're slopping. I fell on my sword. Ugh. And I'll I take thought, it. I thought I'd uh, have that. Oh, thank God. I thought with a 2 1 green, I'd be yep. okay. But. Yep. All right. So I did not make it. Did, did, did not. Mm. So two people made it. So that's 20 points each. So, Jess, you're 25. welcome. I gifted you 25. Oh, come on. <laughs> oh, I could have taken them both. I could have. 
I would I, I would have gotten it, but oh, then you so would have Martin. Yeah. Yeah. So everybody would have gotten it. So I did gift it to you. Guys. Or you would have gifted it to Martin. Either you were... <laughs> so 23 for Shrey. I got three, and Martin got three. 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 So Martin, 70. I got 44. Uh, Shrey at 33. And Jess at 49. Right. So Martin... Was going to win no matter what. It was yeah. just a matter of who was going to take second, and I didn't math it out, and I just tried to maybe somebody would catch Martin. Uh, so there you go. Jess, 49, me, 44, and Shrey at 33. So, all right. Start on that side of the table. So, Mr. Fowler, thoughts on the game? It, I mean, it's a really interesting trick-taking game. I like the combination of visible dice and hidden cards. I love the fact that the dice give you this bidding mechanic that's dynamic that develops as the game goes that's mm -hmm. a really nice touch um i'm not so keen on the fact that numbers and suit both for trumps because I, it confuses me i don't know how much play it would take for me to get the hang of that right because that's not normal right because right. it's kind of yeah. a bit I mean, that, that's a kind of hurts my brain, but not in a good way. It's a okay. kind of remembering yeah. a rule um, hurts your brain as opposed to a strategy play your brain. Um, the, the, the biggest barrier for me with any trick-taking game is there's so many good trick-taking games with regular cards. And as a result, something really has to leap out. And this doesn't quite get there for me. The crew absolutely does because it's just astonishing and this is very very good but if i was going to get into wanted to play a lot of trick-taking games you know the, the siren calls of bridge and the like sort of call to me and say hey you know these have been played for many many years and and all the rest of it but you know after trick-taking games go this is really I, I really like what they've done with the dice i really like um, how they those dice play out it makes it an interesting game a little long though perhaps yeah yeah i i just Despite doing incredibly poorly in this particular game, I I still thoroughly enjoyed it. The um, uh, I can see where it it, it, it can be long, um, uh, but I don't mind that uh, because I you know I just like I like the flow of the game. I like having to evaluate what people are trying to uh, what numbers are people are trying to hit, and uh, and I find that really interesting. Um, I the the this is the first time I've seen a game with that that mixed trump thing, and Moo apparently also does it in certain circumstances, and I haven't had a chance yes, to play I've that. Yes, I've heard that too. I need okay. to try that one of these. I think I actually yeah, I actually bought a copy on a on an auction, just recently. Um, so I will get to try that. Um, Which means we will get to try that. Yay. Good. All right. <laughs> and um, uh, so I, I and, and I find that it's just a just slightly t tweak on top of the the die. Um, the die bidding is is enough for me to like really. I, I totally want to play this a whole bunch of times. See how it see how it plays out. See uh, see how people uh, how it changes with with the interaction. Uh, um, trick taking games is something that that I don't get to play enough of. I feel like so I'm always looking. Um, mm. uh, people are always looking to play like you know the new hot thing, which is often which is usually not a trick. It's just, sure, because so. I mean, a lot of the trick-taking games have been around forever. Yeah, mm. yeah. So, yeah, and passed down generation, generation, that type of thing. Right. How about you? I don't like this one as much uh, as Dekru. Um I love trick-taking games, and um, if you go by our girl Emily, um, that's trick-taking games are going to be the game for 2020. That's her prediction. So um, she loves a good trick-taker. I... I do like this one, but I agree with Martin. It feels like it goes too long, um, but yet it needs to. Everybody needs mm. to lead one, so I, I don't yeah. feel like we need to shorten it up. You have to play it through, but it kind of overstays its welcome for me. It's interesting not knowing what you're going to get um, as far as what you're going to bid for is fun. There's different things to try like you did, like, okay, maybe if I just all go for that color, then people have less control over me. How much should you watch other people and try to make sure they're not getting what their bid ends up being? Or how much does that hurt you? Like there's, so there's a lot of decisions to make just for what it is. I feel like it lasts too long. And if I'm going to pick between the number of trick takers that are out there, 
this isn't going to be the one that I would necessarily pick. That said, if somebody was like, hey, I want to, I brought Nicosa Days, I'd like to play it, I'd be completely up for playing this game. Um, I'd never say no to it, but I don't feel like I need to own it. It's not um, going to be the premiere of this game type for me. For me, the thing that this thing does that's special is the bid changes. Mm. Like, you don't know what you bid until yeah. you're down to one die. And that's what adds to the length, I think, is because you are trying to manipulate your hand every single time you play a card or a die, manipulating it based on what people have played and what you think people hold, plus what dice they have out there. And so every single decision feels like it is a weighty decision. And over the course of four hands, it just takes a while to play. Mm. Um, I think, and may, I don't want to speak for everybody here or anybody at home, but I feel like what we're doing is we're judging this against trick-taking games as opposed to, yes, it is a trick-taking game, but it is not a quick-playing trick-taking game, and it's not mm. trying to be. Yeah. So it, I don't feel like it overstays as long as you look at it for what it is, from my point of view at least. So it makes sense that it, it, it feels like it takes the right amount of time, the one drawback that, or two drawbacks that I've seen is sometimes it's hard to remember I have dice that are cards in front of me, like it just like in Die Crew, right? Mm. To where, okay, I have, oh wait, I have a card that's down here as well. So remembering that, remembering that the number is Trump as well. But also the bigger thing for me, and maybe this is just the way this played out because it's the first of four times that I've played this, that I've seen this, it was almost a moot point if we didn't set Martin that the game was over in the you know the fourth round. If you hit your point, it didn't matter. But there are also other trick-taking games where that is the case to where, oh, if we don't set them, right. or we don't hit a grand tissue or whatever it may be, we don't set them, then they're going to win. So I don't think that's necessarily a fair drawback to this, just trick-taking games in general. And for me, I really like that I don't know what I'm bidding yet and you have flexibility over it and you can manipulate that and other people can manipulate it for you if you do mm. a poor job of planning mm. that so i yeah i like it i i'm a really big fan of this yeah. i think i like die crew equally or the crew equally to it but it's completely different they are completely different animals even though they're both trick-taking games but yeah i've enjoyed both of them that's why i wanted to stream them both so that's my thoughts, anyways. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, I feel that with a game this length, that there's plenty of other games I think I'd rather play. Okay, but, uh, and that's fair. And I, 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 so this kind, of, this, I think the length of this uh, is affected by how much you have to think about it. Uh, there were other trick-taking games that can be on the longer side uh, because you play X number of hands, mm -hmm. like, um, but they're sort of simpler to evaluate your what your decisions are. Yes. So it feels like uh, more casual almost, right? And mm. I think yeah. I think this is this requires your attention, uh, like focused attention, and that might be affecting uh, what, what like. That's a good. That's a really because I'm thinking about Wizard, right? That I, I'm probably the most recent trick taking game that isn't one of these two that I played to where. I don't have to study every single thing that's going on. I can, you know, we can carry on a conversation, we can do all that. Whereas this, I am hyper-focused on what's going on. Um, that's actually a really good point. So I think it's a completely different game in yeah, that regard, like, the like, type uh, of game. The uh, the other, one of the other great director games I enjoyed, uh, De uh, Steep and, De Steep and Siegel, the, uh, the, the slough off is what the, uh, the US version, but uh, is, um, is, it also can be a long game because you want to give everybody a lead, um, but it's also but it, it it fits on the category also. It's, it it's, it has you know you bid up front on on colors and quantity, um, but it feels a lot like more straightforward. Uh, the decisions are also really interesting, and I, I think that's a fantastic trick taker. What is it? It's uh, it, it's it's the seven seals in German. Okay. Uh, I think. Okay. And uh, and and the uh, slough off is the U.S. version. Um, uh, and so uh, you know, that one, I lo that one will always play in a quick like if we're like just oh let's play casual quick trick taker that 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 will that will often come out. Uh, this will require a bit more commitment, which is fine. I I would love for this kind of uh, this kind of weight uh, uh, trick taker to happen more often. 
Fair enough. Anybody else? No. Nope. Hey. Yeah, for me, the trick when, when you talk about the weight, I mean, yes, it's definitely up towards the bridge levels of, of weight. Um, and that's where it gets tr awkward for me, because, I mean, once you get towards this kind of trick-taking game, I don't think they can hold that much weight, at least not for me, with bridge being a possible exception. Um, but even that's hard to judge because it's been decades since I've played bridge with any degree, um, perhaps even at all, actually. Um, so I've forgotten much of what it was to play. Um, and that's, that, that's the challenge. But I mean, I think if you're into trick-taking games, then I would imagine this would be high on your list because the way the dice play uh, and the way that makes the dynamic bidding, it's just really interesting. Yeah, yep. and there's nothing else out there that I've seen that is, yep. does what this does. So success in that regard. There you go. That is Nikosu Dice. So big thanks to everybody here. Thanks to everybody for watching. Thanks to Big Cat Games for hanging out with us tonight mm. uh, as well. That was, that was cool to see. Uh, Victor, get some sleep. Everyone else, have a wonderful weekend. And I will probably see you Sunday at noon for uh, Rise to Nobility, provided we have the players. If not, then I will see you next week. I'm Edward. I'm Jess. I'm Shrey. Well, I'm Martin. You guys have a great rest of your weekend. Take care. Happy birthday party week stuff for Eric and everyone else. Take care, y'all. Good stuff. Mm, Thanks yeah. for the whooping, Martin. Yeah. yeah, you need to get them to like and subscribe. Give me your thumbs! <laughs> Give me your thumbs! <laughs>